Back before the internet existed, we used BBS as bulletin board systems, and that meant that we would use our modems, our telephones, to call each other. So my phone would call your phone. And we used stuff like a Commodore 64, which is my very first computer, that I recently got working again. People have made bulletin board systems available again, uh, and it's through this amazing, ridiculous hack. This is a Y modem that is connected to my Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi did not exist back then, and it's lying to the Commodore 64, and it's telling it that it's an old-style modem. So it's a bridge between a 40-year-old computer and the Internet that didn't exist at the time. Additionally, there's a Raspberry Pi computer inside of this cartridge that is also lying to my Commodore 64 and saying that it's a disk. So it's pretending to have a floppy disk that doesn't exist. And it's pretending to talk to a phone that doesn't exist. So I'm going to load my terminal program up here. And this is using a terminal program. This is like a, a text, think of it as a text mode web browser, except the web didn't exist. Uh, and I can switch it between different modes. This is 40 characters, and this is 80 characters. We're going to start at 300 bits per second. And I'm going to upgrade it to a blistering 2400 bits, not bytes, bits per second. And you can see here in my dusty screen, we're on the Hanselman network. And we're going to say attention dial tone, like we talking to an old-fashioned phone. And we're going to connect to this network address on this port. It's not port 80, like a web browser. We're connecting to that bulletin board system. And it's going to ask us some questions. It's going to ask me questions like, do I have color? Can I do graphics? Look at that. Now, you don't care because you're young and you're on TikTok, but this is the cat's pajamas. My Commodore 64, this computer, is connecting over a pretend modem to another Commodore 64 that's out there in the world. Nostalgia. Let's get email. Looks like I have no mail. We had a heck of a lot of fun doing this kind of stuff, and this was social media before social media.